allocate customer payments on account automatically. After recording a sales payment on account for either a deposit or an overpayment, once a new invoice has been added on the customer account to reduce the invoice amount owed, the payment on account can be allocated to it. Let's look at how to do this automatically. To do this, from the Customers module, click Customer Receipt. Alternatively, from the Bank Accounts module, click Customer Receipt. In the Bank Details section, leave the default bank account selected. In the Customer Details section, select the required customer. Now, from the toolbar, click Wizard. You'll be prompted with these options. Select the option to allocate payments on account to invoices and click Next. The customer account is already selected for you. Change this to a different customer if required. To allocate all payments on account to invoices, click Allocate. In the Receipt Details section, enter the date required for the allocation. If the invoice and sales payment on account are for different dates, we recommend using the later date for the allocation. Leave the reference and extra reference boxes blank, as these will not update on allocation. As we are not receiving any money into the bank account, leave the amount box set to zero. In the bottom half of the window, the receipt column is populated with the amounts being allocated in the order the transactions are displayed. In this example, transaction order. To allocate the transactions, click Save. To close the customer receipt window, click Close. In the customer activity, the outstanding column for any fully allocated invoices and payments on account is now clear. Any part allocated invoices and payments on account will show a value with a P. To view the allocation details, select each transaction. The bottom half of the window shows the allocation details for the selected transaction. To close the customer activity window, click close. You've now learned how to allocate a payment on account to an invoice in Sage 50 accounts.